Uh, nós vamos discutir as perspectivas econômicas. We will be discussing the economic perspectives for Brazil in the next few years, beginning with an evaluation of the international scenario, which is a recovery scenario, with the United States leading this economic recovery. Yet it is still plagued with problems. Problems in Europe, China is growing less than before, the price of oil fell significantly during this period, and Latin America in general is facing a very difficult situation. Practically all relevant countries of Latin America are facing political problems and decreased economic growth, and Brazil is included among them. Unfortunately, economic activity this year is very weak, very bad. We are going to experience a drop in GDP. We have a fairly large recession, which is proving quite challenging for the government, but especially for companies. Inflation is relatively high, and I will try to discuss, above all, what types of challenges companies have to face, which means, how do they adapt themselves to this smaller growth? But, at the same time, the Brazilian economic model is changing. Consumption will grow at a slower pace, which should increase foreign trade and exports since the value of the real is low. There is a devaluation of the real, and Brazil will certainly only overcome the crisis it is experiencing when it not only increases investment in infrastructure, but increases exports. Within this context, Arab countries are very relevant as important commercial partners, whose participation may even increase, with all of the interest of Brazil in once again turning its attention to foreign trade. Likewise, the flow of investments should also increase. So the idea is to show that companies need to reinvent themselves in some manner in the direction of greater efficiency, lower costs, more exports, more innovation, and reinforce their financial position. It is important for the strength of the balance sheet to be greater. In other words, the basic message is that we still have a very difficult year and a half ahead of us. In 2017, Brazil should grow once again, but it will grow in a manner different than in the past. And, what is important is for companies to notice these differences and prepare themselves to coexist and even take advantage of them, such as, for example, export opportunities. This is the message to be discussed today.